Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Nino Kuni 2. Um, we are about to head for the Heartlands, and oh, okay. I, so I was gonna do this off screen, but I really, I wanna. As soon as I took a look at it, I was like, I've gotta, I've gotta show this to everybody, just in case for those of you who aren't, um, aren't playing this game. I think this is really neat. You don't, um, you're not really like spending, uh points here per se you are um you're just like moving it like you just leave it here and then what if you decide like say you decide you want something else instead you just come over here and like put this back and like you know like look at this i don't know i think this is really neat i i'm, I'm excited like here hang on like let me just give an example of um what some of the things are like um for this one, like durability, reduces the amount of damage taken when blocking, uh, increases length of time for which you're invulnerable, invulnerable while evading, um, fleet footedness, which um, allows you to escape from battle easier, uh, dynamism, increases the amount of MP restored by taking damage using items, etc. Um, reduce the length of time it takes to charge up powerful range attacks. Ooh, okay, I'm. I'm really into both uh, eagle-eyedness and brutality. That sounds like something I would uh, be all over. Um, but uh, I just think this is really neat. Like you can just adjust these as you um, as you want. Like you can just change them. You're not like locked in here. Um, uh, increase the amount of money or equipment earned from battle. Um, enables an increase in experience or rare materials earned from, like, just really cool that they're, they're like sliders, like you just slide them, you're not locked into your choices, like you can just choose to, um, choose to, uh, okay, just, this is just super cool, I'm not gonna, like, I don't wanna, Okay, the elements, fire, water, air, light, and dark. Each is strong against certain enemy. Like, it's just, there's a lot here, but it's like really nicely presented and laid out. I think this is, this is fantastic. I'm, I'm really enjoying this. Um, let's see. Oh, we got, okay, we got, wait a minute. So we got the boss's boots, but Batu is wearing them. I think we're gonna probably want to equip our main three with the... Let's see. Hmm. Let's see. I just wanna make sure everybody's equipped with the with uh, good stuff here. Oh, what? Ooh, yes, yes, that's... That's fantastic. Yes, please. Does she use... She's probably more close range. I'm curious to see what type of um, fighter she is, but I'd rather have the main three, I think, unless we absolutely need to use Batu. I think I just want to stick with the, the three main characters for now. Um, maybe Buckler. Interesting. What is all this stuff? Interesting. Okay, cool. As long as like everybody has something, um, you know, I think... Uh, okay. Okay, so she has she has a magic user. Okay, steals items from enemies with success being more likely the bigger the buildup. Okay, cool. And uh, she has lightning attack and air and a, like a lightning arrow attack. Cool. Um. Okay. Cool. 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 Um. And what else does he? So he has these two. I don't think there's much point in like because I'm playing as Evan. Um. And he has his uh, spinning attack, fireball, the water balloon, and I don't know what it is about water-based attacks that always seem like the least badass, like, in every game, like, any water... You know what? No, I take that back. Ex with with the, the one exception being Tales of Zillia, um... This, the character called Rowan, he had this water attack where he would like take his sword and stab the ground and like this just typhoon, like this water tornado like would just erupt from the ground like the entire battle arena would just be completely like sucked up in this giant whirlwind like that's the, <laughs> with that being like the only exception I can think of at the moment. Um, 
are we f so we're totally walking to the heartland so we're not flying so i need to find the uh find the stairs yes here's the stairs all right cool i am so excited so good all right All right, time to navigate this uh, this crazy canyon again. I'm wondering if we should. Uh, now we're probably fine on items. It's fine. We find so much stuff in the overworld. Like, okay. All right. Oh, look, and we can see Lofty with us. All right. So let's see here. So we're going to the Heartlands. Um, all right, so it looks like we have to make it there for now. Um, should we go to that south, that to the to the east, that east bridge, or do we go down? Oh no, I see where we go. So we're gonna go all the way. We're gonna completely bear right this whole time until we get like make a loop down there. Okay, okay, that sounds that sounds uh, that sounds like a plan. Okay. Let's knock. Let's, uh. Oh, she has a spear. Okay, cool. Alright, let's get. Let's get you out of the air, friend. This is not, uh. I love. I think they're my fa the The dark the higgledies. <laughs> Look at that. Just do so much damage. Oh, it's so good. The white ones are really. And the green ones heal, and the white ones do that, like super sweet, like, cannon launch attack. Okay. Am I going the right way? Am I super not going the right way? No, I am. Is this the right way? No, no, that is not the right way. Okay, we're gonna stay to the right here. Uh, skip that guy. He he can live for today. Okay, so we're gonna go around the turn here, right? Okay. Oh. All right, we're gonna fight this whamster. Look at him. Look at all of them. Look at the different colors. Oh my gosh, what? How does the gun shoot that? Maybe I should try, uh... Nah. I was, gonna, I was about to say, like, have Batu in the party for, like, five seconds. I just really like all these characters. Like, I don't know. Have a, whatever. What's the harm in, uh... Uh, here, wait. Here, let's just, like, can I play as Tawny? Yes, yes I can. Cool. Alright, let's do it. The dogs will be just beyond here. The bandits, you mean? Aye. That I do, alright. Time for Kunbish and Chingus to make their sorry hides useful. Let's get this battle underway. Well, plant a standard for our troops to muster beneath. When you're ready to take the field of battle, come there and say the word. Skirmishes. Ooh. Skirmishes are army-on-army -army battles in which Evan takes to the field in command for up to four units. The aim is to have him guide his troops to victory. Interesting. In order to begin a skirmish, approach the standard planted in the ground nearby and order your soldiers to form ranks okay uh maybe i should play as evan for this just a thought um <laughs> oh look batu's yawning he's like oh so tired look at him he looks so tired <laughs> okay i am actually gonna just be evan for now if we're gonna be doing this like this uh skirmish here i i don't know how this is gonna go down 
All right, are you ready to join the fray and take on the battle for the Heartlands? The recommended level for the skirmish is level one. What level am I? Like, is there a sk separate skirmish level? Huh, whatever, let's check it out. Okay. Battle briefings. During briefings, you can prepare your army for the skirmish ahead by checking victory conditions, assessing enemy forces, boosting your might, and picking units. Uh, okay. Interesting. Bolster forces, inspect forces. Check details for your own units and units there. Okay, sure. Do I have to, like, spend points to do this different stuff? Uh. Wow, okay, um. Okay. Okay, your units. What? Wait, by unit is like, is it just two dudes? Like, that's it? What? Okay, oh, oh, okay, um. Okay, wait, so these, these guys are over here. Okay. So where is it pointing when it goes over here? Okay. It's like a keep or something. Um. Okay, it looks like... Okay. Not of in influence to buy boosts. Okay. Muster forces. <laughs> oh, look! You can see, like, their abilities and stuff. Definite. Okay. <laughs> the old heave-ho. <laughs> this unit's attacks knock the enemy back further than usual. Air raid. Calls in a sky pirate raiding party to rain destruction on the enemy ahead of you. This guy, okay, here's the- oh, oh, it's his units! Okay, I was like, is it just these two- <laughs> is it just these two idiots? Like, no, okay. So, Chingus's crew is called the Scurvy Sky Vipers, and Kunbish's group is called the Salty Sky Serpents. Okay. So, do I have to hit, like, okay. Oh, okay, oh, so you can assign- Interesting. This is so okay. And then it's looking military might, the might gauge. So we're at level one, underling, underdog. Um, this tactic can be unleashed when the guts gauge is full. It makes all allied attacks fully effective, regardless of enemy unit type, and greatly reduces might gauge consumption. Cool. Interesting. Wow. And this is all we've got. Okay. Okay. So they're both at level one. Both of their units. Okay. Mobilize forces. Yes. I guess, I mean, right? Like, there's nothing else to really do at this point. I've never done anything like this before. This is really neat. Alright, the Heartland's here. Something, something. No need yet, though. Check out the... <laughs> it goes so fast. Whatever, it's just fine. They're just sizing each other up. Devils never change. Curse them. Okay, to arms! Controlling your units. When a unit Evan controls and counters an enemy, it will attack automatically. You can rotate units to the left using L1 and the right using R1. Oh, what? Oh, you like, you spin them around. Like, you'll need to tell all your units what you need them to do. Okay, just, just, just fight. Just, okay. What? You're just like kind of spinning them around and, um, oh, they're kicking ass. Woo! What? Are these captains or something? What's going on here? Can you, uh, okay. Wait, are they gone? Like, what happened? Okay. Cool. Alright, the might gauge. By holding down one or another button, you can have your forces move more quickly or launch an all-out assault that will see them attack the enemy in a fast, furious fashion. Sounds good. Hold X to quick march, and hold square for an all-out assault. Okay, X to quick march, right? Okay, by holding... no, okay. Alright, let's go! Let's do this! Okay, right, yeah, no, I'm doing it. Yeah. Cool, oh my gosh, what? Okay, only when the gauge down there. Okay, interesting. 
Whoa. Unit types. Each unit type is strong against certain other units. Sword is strong against hammer. Hammer is strong against spear. Spear is strong against sword. Okay, so it's like a triangle. Okay, sword is good against hammer. Hammer is good against spear. Spear is good. Okay, I'm just um, I'm gonna make a little diagram here in a second here. When your troops are at an advantage, you will see a blue arrow, and when they're at a disadvantage, a red one. Okay, try to keep your units in the most advantageous positions. Okay. All right. Okay. Whoa, look at this little, like... Just, like, walk around laying waste. Where are my dudes? Are they all dying? Like, is this... Okay. Each unit can deploy its own special tactic. These can be used when the unit's special tactic gauge is full, but be aware that this will cost military might. Okay. All right. Military might is the power you use in to order your units on the battlefield. You'll have a different amount depending on the type of engagement. So try your best to use it wisely. Chingus's special tactic calls down sky skimmers to bombard the enemy. Kun Kunbish's special tactic temporarily roots the enemy to the spot with terror. Cool. Can you use both? Can you, like, make them freeze and then, like, bomb them from the sky? Hold R2 and press. Do, do, do. <laughs> press all the things to activate a special tactic. Okay. Woo! Me, Tyrant of the Untamed, King of something something. Oh, am I like missing dudes? Uh, where are they? Where are all my dudes? Did they all die? This is terrible. This is. Wait a minute. Okay, there's swords. Let's just do sword swords on swords, right? Okay. Okay. So they want. Cool! Oh my gosh! Man! Alright, you Drago, <laughs> you Drongos, <laughs> he's like, I can't... <gasps> Wait, my eye, don't listen to an Evan. Onward! Okay. Calling for reinforcements. Yes, please. <laughs> a unit's current health can be gauged by how many soldiers it has. To replenish it, hold circle to spend some military might on calling for reinforcements. Okay. Do we have to... Oh, wait. No, no, no. No. The wrong button. <laughs> okay. If units... Okay. We can't afford to lose! How long... Oh, okay. Cool. Do, 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 do. This is really neat. Okay, do we go through this gate? This is where we go, right? Alright, Evan. Let's do this. Alright. Okay. Come on, guys. Let's just, uh... Come on! Can't figure out how to get around that? Get over here! Get over here! Okay. Heck no! Get out of here! Okay. Oh, what? Take that, stupid flippin' siege tower! <laughs> what is this? Do I get to... Alright, where are we going? Wait, hold on. Oh, we have to go around- oh, we have to defeat the gate. Okay, that makes sense. Do, 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 do. 
All right, neutralized. All right, what's in here? What is this? All right. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna do this. So Evan really is like leading people into fight. Like, I wonder if Nella taught him this stuff. Like, that'd be really interesting. All right, shock tactics. Activate shock tactics to make all unit types effective against all others and greatly slow down the rate at which the might gauge is depleted. If your units are poorly matched or you're in trouble, try pre pressing triangle. Ooh. Hey, I thought you would just wait for me. Why not think you're... Okay, I can't. Forget it. I'm just not even... Gonna... <laughs> Hold on. All right. Okay, do we have to, like, destroy... Yeah, it's probably gonna make us, uh... <laughs> Man, this guy just won't die! <laughs> he just won't die. <laughs> like, you'll pay for this indeed. There's original. <laughs> Come on, everyone. We have to get back to the heartlands. Thank you so much, everyone. Oh, cool! That's so neat. Very cool. Oh, and Evan's so sweet. He's very endearing. Yeah. Easy peasy. And that laddie is how it's done. Don't you go forgetting now. I shan't. Thank you, everyone. Okay, the army menu. The army menu can be accessed from the main menu. Here you can check the capabilities of the units that you'll be that you'll use in army on army skirmishes and when you've recruited enough of them pick which ones will go into battle. I really liked that uh the dive bombing thing and well freezing them in place was pretty good too. They're both like really uh really neat. All right. The rubbly ruins trip door has been activated. Very good. Excellent. Ooh. What? Okay, sure. We'll fight you. Why not? Bring it on. Okay. Come on. Evan's kind of badass, actually. Like, he might, you know... He might not look like much at first glance, but he's got some... He's got some power in him. He's kind of feisty. Alright, where's, uh... Someone healed me. The Higgledies. You guys are great. Here. Let's, uh, let's lock on to somebody here. Roland! That that attack, though. It's so good. Yes, the darkness. So good. <laughs> so good. It's so satisfying. The music. Get over here. Look at this. Get over here. So good. Okay, get all the loot. All right, I got. Hmm, are we crossing the uh, the bridge? Looks like it. Yeah. <laughs> Here we are at last, the Heartlands. Not bad. Not bad at all. Yeah. There's a lovely cool breeze, isn't there? Golly. We're really going to do it, aren't we? We're going to build a kingdom. Yep. Pretty cool.
<laughs> Yar, that's all the tents pitched. Thank heaven for that. I'm pooped. But we can't live in tents forever. We'll need to think about putting something more permanent in place. And for that, we'll need natural resources. Mm. Ah, yes. Building materials. Right, some good quality wood would be a start. Well, that's easy enough. The forest to Nial's just down the way. We'll go and chop ourselves a few choice logs, shall we? Oi. You can't just go chopping down trees willy-nilly. What do you think Nial will have to say about that? I'm guessing he's the owner of the forest. Yes. Yes, he's the leader of the Greenlings. They're the creatures who live there. Nothing happens in the woods without his permission. Then we must go and speak with him. I'm sure he'll give us his blessing if we explain the situation. Ha! You've clearly not met Niall, lad. He's an incurable old skin fit. Skin fit? <laughs> Tighter than a hangman's noose he is. You'll get nothing out of him for free. Mark my words. Tighter than a hangman's noose. Then we'll just have to cut a deal. I've brought my fair share of hard-nosed customers to the negotiating table in my time. Mm -hmm. What's that now? Mm, never mind. Let's go see this Niall, shall we? Alright. We're going to see the master of the forest. Head for the forest of Niall. Awesome. I can't wait. Alright guys, it uh, looks like a good spot to take a break, but thanks so much for tuning in. Looking forward to next time. And uh, before you head out, just be sure to uh, like and subscribe. It uh, really helps keep me motivated. So thanks so much for watching everyone. See you soon.